TaylorTheBuilders.com. Taylor, a smarter way to build. Pitch to Marte, grounded to short, double play ball. Done to second one, Baker to first for two. The official transportation company for the wings. Another 2-2, Beatty swings and misses. The fastball strikes him out. Three and two, DJ Stewart's on deck. The payoff, Ritter bounces it up the middle. Baker is sliding back and stop behind second. Throws the first dugout by Manessas, and Ritter is retired. Heck of a play. The big man from St. Louis is 1-1, a 1-0. Skied into shallow right. Dropping quickly, Joey Gallo though gets there and makes the catch. Stewart dancing down the third base line, and the pitch on the way is a curveball for a swing and a miss. Strike three. Again, the pitch on the way, breaking ball, hammered high in the air to left field. Ritter's going back, he nears the pitch. It is gone! Brady House takes one to the house. One nothing Red Wings, that thing was smoked. Over the Bermuda Triangle. That's one of those, you could tell by the sound that it was crushed. Estimated at 400 to 5 feet. The 1-1 one, one from Hamels lined the other way to right. It's not a homer, but it is a sharp base hit for Joey Manessis. He's on base with one out and a run already in. 3-1 to Alou, line to right down the line. That's a fair ball. It goes into the corner. Manessis chugs his way around to third base. Billy McMillan is giving him the wave around. Acuna's throw home, and the tag is waiting from Allen. Manessis tagged out in front of home plate as he slides in. Alou gets a double. Righty's 2-0, lash toward short, a base hit in the left field. Lipscomb drives home Alou. Two to nothing, Red Wings, and an RBI single from Lipscomb in his first game period in about a week. Lipscomb leads at first base, he's not running. The pitch, line to center, a sharp hit for Dunn. Lipscomb rounds second, but stops. It's another hit for the Red Wings, their fifth in a row. From the stretch, Rutledge brings it home. Swing and a miss, he struck him out with the fastball. The base is juiced with one out in the top of the third. The pitch to Stewart, swung on and missed, another strikeout. First pitch to Gilbert, left hand batter pops it up. Third baseman Trey Lipscomb retreating into the outfield grass in fair territory. He makes the catch. Drew Millis is on deck in the payoff pitch again. Curveball bounced past the mound toward the middle. Acuna backhands at second. Tough throw across his body is in, not in time at first. Baker beats it out. Baker runs this time. The pitch is low. Allen's throw. Baker is safe diving in there. 36 steal for Darren Baker. Delivery to Millis, Drew smacks one deep to right field, way up in the air, and it is way out of here. Onto the roof of the Nest Picnic Pavilion down the right field side. The Red Wings double up their lead on their second home run of the ball game. This time Millis, it's a two run blast. It's four to nothing Rochester backslash Rochester to find out more. Connect to banking done different. Brady House drills one in the air to right center over the head of Marte and bouncing up over the fence. House has added an automatic double to his resume tonight. A home run, now a double for House. The one strike pitch, swing, and that's a high fly ball to deep left. Ritter's going back to the warning track, looking up. You can't forget it. Another towering home run from a Red Wing, this time off the bat of Syracuse tormentor, Joey Manessis. Throwing in the pen, the 3-2, swing and a miss. He struck him out, got him tied into a knot. Left-handed batter Allen swings at the first pitch and skies it in the air to shallow center field. The shortstop done going back, and he's gonna make the catch even though Cruz was coming in hard from center field strikeout victims for Rutledge. Again, here comes the 3-2 with the runner going. Swing and a chopper to second. Backing up on it is Baker. Makes the throw to first, and that'll retire the side. Going up against Starling Marte. Missed outside with ball one and already into the windup. The second pitch off the handle. Slow roller to short. 
Dunn waits for it, now throws to first, and plenty of time to retire Starling Marte. From pick of the Mets in 2019 out of high school in Texas. The pitch, swing and a miss, or did he get a piece? Nope, he got him. Here comes the 0-1. Swing and a chopper left side, slow roller, but an easy force play for Lipscomb at third. And the big left-hander. Into the windup, the one-two. Swing and a fly ball into the alley in right center. Long run for Gallo coming in, dives and makes the catch. And back to the top of the lineup, and Luis Angel Acuna takes strike one and then swings at the second pitch and hits an absolute rope, but right at the center fielder, Dylan Cruz. One of my favorite things in baseball. The pitch, and that's a jam job right at the second baseman. Baker has really got in the hands of Marte. If you would have asked me this, I would have been guessing all night long. As the first pitch line right back up the middle by Jack Dunn and into center field. So a hard hit ground ball up the middle off the bat of Dunn. The pitch. Swing and a high fly ball. Deep left center field back towards the Bermuda Triangle. And it's out of here. Dylan Cruz with a long two-run homer, and the Red Wings extend the lead to 8-1. To Dylan Cruz really coming alive now. That's his third home run in the last four games. We're really seeing him hit for some more extra base power. 